Global Marketing Communications Company, Netcore Solutions, held a power-packed forum involving major stakeholders with the theme, Unleash the Power of Transactional Emails to Maximize Return on Investment. Delivering a keynote speech, Abithab Baskar, Group Senior Vice President, Global Sales, describes transactional emails as one-to-one -one emails that contain information that completes a transaction or process the recipient has started with you. See, transactional emails to a great extent is a trigger-based communication. You go to website, and website, a lot of information is available to attract a customer. You do a lot of advertisements in the market to attract a customer. But you don't have 100% guarantee that those customers will come to you. The moment customer comes and signs the form and gives an email ID and the mobile number, how instantly the bank communicate back is what you're talking about, the trigger. It is not one to many, it is one on one. So you can associate now, it is, it is one on one. It goes one at a time, or if multiple people are like requesting it, it goes that many number of people. It will not go to the other people uh, at the same time. Right? That is one way of transactional communication. Certain communications are within three seconds, the OTP. Customer needs an email within three seconds, and customer has to get that email in the inbox. Today, the major challenge is happening is, Googles and Yahoo's and Hotmail's and all these companies, they put your mails on the spam box. They put your mail on the non-priority box. Now just imagine a customer who's already dealing with you, you're doing a high value transaction with them, and if their mail is landing in spam box or the non-priority box, what's the image of your organization? You're getting it, what I'm saying? So, it is important for you to understand what are the nuances which is there to make sure that this mail doesn't land in the spam boxes or the non-priority box. It has to reach on the inbox. And furthermore, this customer is waiting for my mail and I cannot delay that mail. I have to deliver within three seconds or maybe two seconds. And then the most important thing is I also should have a confirmation whether that mail has been received, whether that mail has been opened, whether the mail has been clicked and actioned upon. So that's where you know the difference is happening today. Most of the companies, they invest good amount of money in doing the marketing activity on an email databases they have. They spend a good amount of money in identifying the service provider who can support them. And you know, one product is Netcore, there are multiple other products available in the market as well to take care of your promotional communication. They will give you all kinds of the reports of opens, clicks, delivered, undelivered, you know, the how many transactions happened after that and all those things. But unfortunately, the transactional communication is nobody's looking at it because this piece of the activity is mostly handled by the IT department and the marketing department. The IT department have put up an SMTP server, a bandwidth connection has been taken from the, uh, the ISP, and your application has been diverted to route the traffic through this gateway and that mail is going over there. So this product, what I'm going to give it across to you, this product known as Falconite, that has got a power to behave and give you all the things as good as the promotional uh, you know, product gives. All the kind of the reporting is available. All the kind of the benefits are available. You can get everything. Now, when it comes to a technology like this, speed is the most important thing. So what we have, we can deliver the email in less than five seconds. Yeah. How many seconds these emails can get shoot? Your application server, SMTP location, all those things matters. If you're communicating to a Nigerian customer, if I have a server in Nigeria, the things will be much faster. Or we need to know that which channel the, the connectivity is much faster. So we have put up our servers and IDT, IDC in such a way that we can take care of any level of communication, any volume of communication. So what's the benefits now from Netcore? You know, all these things are pretty much possible. There are multiple other providers like me also is available to service you. What is that which we can bring in? I have a power to deliver the email in less than five seconds. I am handling top banks in the globe. I am handling top financial institutions. I have the power to deliver it. We have been fiddling around with mail communication for the last 20 years. And we know the language much better than anybody else in this globe. 
when the email started, we have been fiddling around with that. We are playing with that. So we understand the logical steps behind it. All right. 0.2 milliseconds latency report is something which I can just tell you. Your mail is gone. What's the milliseconds it's taking to deliver? That much in-depth analysis is what I can bring it across to you. That much of information I can bring it across in the form of a report. You send 100,000 mails. This is how the latency reports are. All right. I can process at a given time more than 10 million emails. So if you have like 10 million plus emails, you would want to process at the same time. I have the capacity to accommodate that, process it, and deliver to the internet world. That's the capacity. I've got a server farm. I've got multiple country IDC to take care of the horizontal server failure and the IDC failure and the country IDC failure. Because at any given point in time, when you process a mail, whether it's 100 mails or a 10 million mails and things like that, I will ensure that without delay, these mails are getting processed. Report? The second, a real-time report. So when your mail has been sent, how this mail delivery is happening on the other end, you can see it real-time. How many of them are getting bound, how many of them are getting dropped, delivered, opened, clicked, how many of them are getting unsubscribed, you know? Mails are getting opened up in which IP, which browser, whether it's mobile, I, I mean iPhone or Android. All this information is what you will be able to see. You can see that on the infra side, we have got huge server farm, multiple IDCs. All of these things are horizontally, you know, automatic expandable. So that any mail at any given point in time, if it goes to a level above, you know, by default, the infra is getting plugged in. And the team who's monitoring the service 24 by 7 is again make a difference to you. So you don't have to worry about how the mail is getting processed. That is getting processed to a server. We are there to take care of you. Speaking of transactional communication, uh, how do you think this would uh, affect or change the face of advertising in Nigeria today? Because this is uh, changing the way uh, brands interact with their customers. See, today if you look at it, the way the marketers spend that money, a uh, good percentage of the money they allocate for Googles and what is happening is they put the banner and how many people sees that banner, we call it impressions. And every impression, X amount of dollars is getting deducted from their wallet. So wherein, uh, on the promotional side, they are sending a lot of mailers and the mails are not getting opened or not getting responded properly. On the other side, they are sending a lot of transactional mail. Transactional mails are you do a banking transaction and you get an email saying that you did so much of money transaction. Uh, you get an end of the month statement. A uh, lot of you know e-commerce companies, uh, you know, communicate to them about their bills, their shipment details, and uh, things like that. So there is a customer, and you can reach out to that customer in multiple ways. And traditionally what we have seen, the percentage of open rates is much more than 50% and it goes as high as 60, 70 or it, at, in certain cases goes more than 90 percentage. So the open rates are higher, visibility is higher, but unfortunately this space is used only for a typical text-based communication. So only the information which is restricted to that transaction has been communicated, whereby you can bring in a lot of innovation in that page. I mean, talking about the A4 size page, where the horizontal space are available, the vertical space are available, the footer is available. You can have a picture over there. You can have a brand communication over there. You can do a cross-selling, up-selling over there. So we have shown over here how you can innovate and ensure that this channel, as of now, which is a redundant channel, can be utilized. So if you're getting 50,000, 50 percentage of the impression, you know, just imagine that's the kind of the return you can enjoy in terms of getting an upselling, cross-selling, and things like that. So, which is what we would want to, you know, handhold and help these organizations and make sure that this ignored channel being used for now, making, a, you know, revenue for these organizations. See, transaction emails are basically very important for each and every organization. Normally what happens, we try to neglect this kind of emails because it's just that you have to send this email just for because somebody has transacted on your website or on your mobile app for, or banks especially uh, if they are going for an ATM transaction or anything. 
Now over here in advertising also, normally what happens when any person is doing any kind of transaction on your website, so you need to do a cross sell. You know that the person is going to open that email for sure. Study says that approximately 75 to 80 percent people open your email whenever they do any kind of transaction. So why not utilize it to you know make it something else? Why not utilize it to you know actually do a cross sell or do a upsell? So that is what basically is going to be affecting a various organizations when they start using and start understanding the importance of transaction emails. So for advertising also, it can be for any organization. So it's not just for advertising. It can be any banking organization, anybody and anyone who can sell online, anyone who transacts online, transaction emails are very important for them. The benefits of this innovation from Netcore include delivery of emails within five seconds, capable of delivering 10 million emails an hour per client. Experts and dedicated delivery experts team 24-7, to mention a few. This innovation is poised to completely redefine customer relationship management as tracking will bring useful insights, which eventually will transform into revenue. Ultimately, a combination of automation and real-time action is the key to success.